Hi there, my name's Nigel and I'm a local London guide. And today I'm going to take you to some of the amazing places in this rather remarkable city. So here we are at um, Tower Bridge, one of the most iconic sites in London. It's actually not as old as it looks. It was uh, opened in 1894 and was the brainchild of one of the great Victorian architects, uh, Horace Jones. And it was meant to be a statement, um, a statement really welcoming trade from around the world to London, the greatest trading city in the world during the 19th century. The road there lifts up uh, to allow tall ships to go through it. And there's a wonderful story from 1952 when one of the London double-decker bus drivers decided to jump. He jumped the lights uh, and there was a 10-foot gap. He hit 60 miles an hour and managed to make it. London Transport awarded him with a, a day off. Nobody knows what happened to the terrified passengers, of course. So London is full of places which are just tucked away. And this little place here, of course, is the stairwell to uh, the very first underground railway uh, that existed in London. And this was a small railway, a small tunnel that went under the Thames across to the South Bank. Uh, and this is all that remains of it. It was partly destroyed and partly um, affected by the Blitz, of course, because a couple of bombs um, hit it during uh, the uh, Second World War. Uh, and this is what re uh, remains of it. Fascinating piece of uh, railway history here. OK, so here we are in the basement of the, this hairdresser's in Leadenhall Market. So why are we here? Well, we're here because um, down here in the, in the bowels of this building uh, are the remains of the Roman Basilica and Forum from the very first century. This building was the largest building north of the Alps within the Roman Empire. And these are the remains of that particular building. It's the outer wall. So here we are in the crypt of All Hallows Church. Uh, and the crypt has stories to tell. We know that there was a Roman dwelling here because there's evidence there of uh, the flooring uh, from somebody's house. And right next door to it, they found um, these gravestones, these Roman gravestones. Uh, and as a result, of course, of all the Roman history here, they've decided to build a, um, a model of what Roman London looked like. And here you can see the size of it. Uh, and indeed, you can see the main buildings and the Roman Forum and Basilica uh, and the Roman Amphitheatre is is, um, is shown here, uh, along with the very first bridge uh, across the Thames. 